So the commentators Gold Cup next up then. This is a one mile two for on class six handicap, 0 to 75. And the top one is Courageous Dancer Martin, leader mobilised Obi Wan, sign of the times Derek Hinton, Grey Lamy Boy, Doug Warren, Loud Sylvestris, Darren House, Cattle Van Stu Grey, Quick Return, Daniel French, JR Speed Date, James Wheeler, Yarpole, James Follis, Graceful Oryx, Mayor's Ad Mystery, and Autumn Cape, Alex Cherry. So 11 again then. And they're all quietly installed again as well, and away they go. A little bit slow to go on the far side was Sign of the Times, and Lad Sylvestris just about the leader, but now on the inside, Autumn Cape has got that rail, and looks like it's got a lead. Alex Cherry logs his horses up the front, and so too does Mayor's Ad Mystery, so Autumn Cape and Graceful Oryx are going to dispute the lead, and they're a good three lengths clear of Lad Sylvestris, and a pace that doesn't appear to be that hot. Then comes Sign of the Times, who was slowly away, and he's already up into third, and Derek Hinton logs his horses to the fore as well, doesn't he? So it's quick return after that one, and then Yar Pole and Mobilise, then Grey Army Boy, Cattle Van is next, then Courageous Dancer and JR Speed Date is just the back marker at this stage. So passing the seven pole then, and Graceful Oryx has won the battle to lead with Autumn Cape in second. Sign of the Times is third, and Land Sylvestris is fourth. Then comes Queen Return after that one, then Mobilise and Yar Pole, Grey Army Boy is after that, then Cattle Van and Courageous Dancer already being given the hurry up, and the back marker is JR Speed Date. So Grace Florix then has now got a three length lead as he comes down towards the five furlong pole and starts to swing right handed. Loud Sylvester has moved through into second as Autumn Cape comes under a bit of pressure. Then Sign of the Times is fourth and then Quick Return is fifth. A bit of a gap then to Yarpole and Mobilise. Cattle Vans running a bit wide on the track. Grey Army Boys under pressure. Courageous Dancer looks a bit one paced and JR Speed Date is right out the back but Grey Florix leads by a length then to Loud Sylvester is in second. Quick Return looks to be swinging on the steel nicely. Then comes Sign of the Times. Autumn Cape's after that one. Cattle Van is behind them. He leads the trailing group but are about four lengths behind the remainder but it's Graceful Oryx in the lead then from Loud Sylvestris and Sign of the Times then Quick Return then Autumn Cape it seems to be between these at the moment as they race into the final furlong and a half in there and it's Loud Sylvestris in the lead from Graceful Oryx and Sign of the Times Quick Return hasn't got going like it looked like he would and Loud Sylvestris looks like he might have stolen this one Sign of the Times is trying to chase him but Loud Sylvestris jockey has a little look round he's inside the final half furlong Sign of the Times is trying to wear him down but Loud Sylvestris is going to take this quite easily and Loud Sylvestris wins it Sign the time second courageous dancer from nowhere for third and cattle van may have been last but it's loud sylvestris for darren howells the odds on favorite takes it easily doesn't he sign of the time second for Derek hinton courageous dancer for martin legan was third quick return for daniel french looked to be going like a winner two furlongs out daniel french was fourth and graceful oryx mayor's had mystery the long-time leader was fifth